in February of 2022, Perseverance scooped up a potato-sized rock in its left front wheel. In a strange coincidence, a second one came aboard in February 2023 in the right front wheel. So are these Martian hitchhikers cause for concern? On this episode of Mars Guy. In 2004 in Gusev Crater, the Spirit Rover was the first to inadvertently pick up a loose rock in one of its hollow wheels, which stalled the motor. The rover drivers called it a potato-sized rock in their report, and the name has stuck for such a rock ever since. After trying out various maneuvers, the rover drivers found that backing out of the thickest sand and rotating the rover a bit freed the potato from the wheel. Fast forward to 2022 in Jezero Crater, half a world away, where Perseverance picked up a potato while traversing a gap in Artubi Ridge, see episode 47. Here's Mars Guy for scale. Perseverance has much bigger wheels than Spirit, so this rock looks smaller, but it's actually about the same size as Spirit's potato, just over 5 inches or about 13 centimeters. Those big wheels mean that a rock this size is too small to jam any hardware, so it can just ride along harmlessly, which it's been doing for more than a year now, with no apparent damage to the wheel. In late February of this year, Perseverance was making daily drives across what's now referred to as the upper fan to distinguish it from delta deposits, see episode 99. Somewhere along its sixth consecutive drive, it picked up a rock which has a similar size and shape as its first potato. Here's the view of the terrain where it happened. It's a veritable potato field. Despite the abundance of potential passengers, it appears that no others have been picked up. The views out back capturing the rear wheels show no potatoes, but the interior of the middle wheels can only be viewed with the robotic arm-mounted Watson camera, which happened in late January of this year. This was the pose used during the sample tube drops when Perseverance was building the sample depot, see episode 95. The original potato is nicely displayed, but none are evident in any other wheels. It's possible that there's been a new arrival in a middle wheel after traversing the potato field, but we won't know until Watson takes a look. The Curiosity rover in Gale Crater apparently has managed to avoid picking up any potatoes. This view was taken with its arm-mounted camera in August of 2015, three years after it arrived. There are no potatoes evident in any of its wheels, but what is evident is how damaged the wheels are. They started out with holes designed to leave repeating marks in the wheel tracks, but the gashes were created by Mars. This is the widely reported discovery that Curiosity's wheels were being damaged by sharp embedded rocks along its early traverse. But testing these wheels to failure in the Mars yard at the Jet Propulsion Lab has showed that it will take many years before Curiosity's wheels become a problem. The wheels of Perseverance were redesigned to be more robust. They're a bit narrower with a tighter tread or grouser pattern and thicker aluminum in between. This made them heavier, which required changes elsewhere in the system, but clearly it's a robust design. Now we can watch in the coming years to see how many hitchhikers come on board and whether these two go along for the full ride. Stay tuned for future sequels.